So early on, we got some OIs that related to things like uh, work environment. There were not enough chairs in the labor and delivery unit. The shower curtain in the call room wasn't uh, hitting the floor, so water was getting all over the floor, those sorts of things. And as those OIs got acted on and people could see that there were changes, they began to put in more and more important kind of opportunities for improvement. And it's interesting, over the last um, year and a half or so that we've been doing this now, uh, we've had over 120 OIs that have been completed and, and worked on. And these really are, um, again, range from sort of the, the banal and, and simple to much more complex things. For instance, uh, we had a uh, very difficult delivery happen some time ago, at which point a patient had to have a hysterectomy during the middle of a cesarean section. Following such a hysterectomy, um, the common practice is to do a cystoscopy where one looks into the bladder uh, to make sure that the ureters in the bladder have not been injured. The resident who did that case afterwards was quite frustrated because the uh, cysto tower didn't work properly. Um, and promptly put in an OI saying, look, this is really important, these things happen with unfortunately uh, some regularity and we need the equipment working. The labor and delivery uh, team that went about trying to figure out what had happened to it found out in fact that the uh, Cisto team, uh, Cisto tower was in fact working but there was a user error. Um, and it was really gratifying to see that the resident who put this in and the team that was involved in that particular case didn't get defensive about that. Um, the learning that happened uh, because of this OI uh, was really an important one. Uh, number one, it made the teams all look at uh, how the tower actually is supposed to work and it reinforced uh, trust between the uh, uh, nursing team and the physician team to be able to say, look, this was not a uh, uh, equipment problem, it was a user problem. I think this is a real tribute to um, Kinexus as well as other efforts that we're putting forth at UNC to develop a culture of uh, quality and improvement. People now uh, increasingly feel like when they have something that they want to suggest uh, that it will be heard.